everyone and welcome to the breakdown today I'm gonna be teaching you how to download and install not enough items in Minecraft 1.12.2 Before we jump on into this video, I want to remind you it's brought to you by game servers Go to the breakdown.xyz slash MC server That's the first link down below to get an awesome 24-hour DDoS protected Minecraft server for just one dollar per month You're not gonna find a better deal out there. Check it out first link down below now How do you install not enough items? Well before we can install not enough items we need Forge, what it runs on. So to do that, go to the second link down below. It will take you here where you can scroll down and see the big green download Forge button. Click on that and it will take you off to here where you want to find the version of Forge that corresponds with the version of not enough items you're installing. In this case, 1.12.2. If you were doing 1.12, you would go to that, but we want 1.12.2. So make sure it says 1.12.2 right there. If it does, go ahead and download the installer under download latest. It will then take us off to add focus where you don't want to click anything. Don't click anything on this page until you've waited six seconds and there's a big red skip button in the top right. Then click that skip button. It will then download Forge, which we want to keep because it's 100% safe. It's been downloaded by millions of people and now we can close out of ad focus now we need to download not enough items to do that go to the third link down below it will take you here where you want to click on files and then you want to click on the 1.12.2 or whatever version you're installing of not enough items right here 1.12.2 boom that'll work download that file probably have to confirm yes that we want to keep this file it's been downloaded by 167,000 people it's safe. Now we're not done downloading yet. We still need to download just enough items. This is required now to make sure not enough items runs. It's kind of part of the back end. So to download this, you go to the fourth link down below. It will take you here where you can then click on files. You would want to download the 1.12 version right here. As you can see, 1.12.2, that works. This particular version has been downloaded 3,000 times, but the overall mod has been downloaded 17 million. So I think we're safe. Go ahead and click on the download button next to the 1.12.2 version. Downloads that. We want to keep it. And we're still not done downloading. You want to go to the fifth link down below to download this code chicken library which is required for NEI. You then want to come over here to files where you'll then last but not least see version 1.12.2 right there and then click the download file button. This has been downloaded 933,000 times so we can keep it it's safe. Now, if we minimize our browser, we have four things on our desktop. Forge, not enough items, just enough items, and Code Chicken Library. We want to start off with Forge. Right click on it, open with Java TM Platform SE Binary. You then want to make sure Install Client is selected. Click OK and boom, successfully installed Forge Client Profile. Click OK and we can drag this to the side. Now we need to install these three mods. To do this, hit the Windows key on your keyboard and R at the exact same time. Type in percent, app data percent, percent app data percent and hit enter. It'll then open up the roaming folder. We then want to go into dot .minecraft craft and you should have a mods folder. But Nick, I don't have a mods folder. What do I do? Well, just right click on it, create a new folder, and title it mods. M-O-D-S, all lowercase, exactly like that. Now, drag your three mods, not enough items, just enough items, and the code chicken library into this mod folder. You can then delete them from your desktop if you would like. And now we want to open up the Minecraft launcher. I'll see you guys there. Once you're in the Minecraft launcher, we need to make sure you've got the Forge version that you want selected. To do this, go down here here next to the play button click the little green arrow and click on the profile title forge you then should be able to hit play however if you have an issue come back to the minecraft launcher here click on launch options go to the forge profile click on the version drop down next to forge scroll all the way down to the bottom and you should have a few different forge versions most likely you then want to click on the one with the highest number on the end it's going to be 1.12 at the beginning and then the highest number on the end so if this for example we had two then it was two 254, right? 2,554, for example, and 2,624, we would want to go with the 2,624, which is what we have. Then click save. 
go back to news, make sure that forwards profile is selected again, and hit play. And congratulations, Not Enough Items is now installed in Minecraft 1.12.2. Once you're on the main menu, it's easy to confirm it's installed. Just go to the mods folder here, scroll down, and you will see Not Enough Items, Just Enough Items, and the Code Chicken Library. We can also launch into Minecraft, any world, and be able to clearly see Not Enough Items up and running. There you guys have it. It really is that easy. If you've got any questions, please post them in the comment section down below. And remember, this video is brought to you by Game Servers, the breakdown.xyz slash MC server. First link down below to get an awesome Minecraft server for just $1 per month. Subscribe to the channel for more incredible Minecraft videos every single week. Like this video if it helped you out. I'm Nick. This has been The Breakdown, and I'm out, guys. Peace.